you're you're sharing that company as well. How can somebody like me, who's really committed and wanting to grow within their own organization, uh, how does that personal brand play into the way that you market yourself internally? And I know the first thing that I think of is my annual performance and development re review cycle, but I'm assuming there's mm -hmm. other ways you can advocate for yourself outside of cycle as well. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, when you, um, when you're out there online, when you're sharing your profile or you're commenting on stuff and you're with a company at the time, you're, you're sharing that company as well. Right. Yeah. So like companies should be appreciative of individuals who are sharing their, um, sharing on LinkedIn, you know, getting out there because they're also representing that company and that company's name is also getting out there as well. So, um, I think, and also just like keeping track of those accomplishments can always be something that can, you know, come back to, um, like be reasons for a raise or be reasons for a promotion or, um, you know, things that you can come back to. I've had clients who were like, I've been thinking about asking for a raise, but it's, you know, it's just been so hard to do that. And then we go through their accomplishments and we're like, last year you saved the company $1.3 million. Go back to them and say, I want a raise. I saved you $1.3 million. Can you cut me a little bit of that? Right? Like, so, yeah. you know, when you, when you can really provide something tangible like that to the company, then it does, um, offer you some additional opportunities that maybe wouldn't have been able to be done before. You're still playing in the basin while I'm working on arrangements. They heard the kid in 50 countries. Thank God that's amazing. But I'd rather thank Spotify. They put me on the station.